I'm gonna post a real short video here. My throat's been <laughs> pretty rough. Had a, had a cold over the weekend. But I've been getting a, a misfire. This number one cylinder. And I suspected it was it was the fuel injector. Because I'd pull the fuel injector wire off and it <clears throat> wouldn't change any. Um, but anyway, I went, did, went ahead and did compression test test on each cylinder. It was about 185 on each cylinder, so that looked good. Um, normally, what you hear on the internet is not to do a leak down test after that, but I went ahead and did a leak down test on each cylinder. And number, oddly, number four was like 15 pounds difference or percent whatever you want to say and i thought that was kind of bad <clears throat> but then i went on to number three and two and they were terrible i mean they were probably 50. um I, one of them was the intake valves exhaust valves oh the number four by the way had had a lot of uh leak by the rings um for that 15 percent um so yeah, two and three was good on leaking by the rings. It was intake and exhaust valve, especially number two had a lot in the exhaust valve. But anyway, um, here's the sad part of the story. Got got to that number one, put the leak down on it. Had to, I'm gonna set this phone down just for a minute here. I hook the compressor up and I'll show you what, what the problem is. And there it is. It's bubbling out the radiator, which most likely means I got a blown head gasket. So yeah, um, I think it's a common problem with these engines. But my immediate thoughts is it's about time to pull this thing out and fix a, a lot of various problems with it. <clears throat> it's been low on power for, I feel like, maybe the last 50,000 miles. So um, maybe it's been a slow, slow problem with culminating with this uh, most likely head gasket failure. So anyway, I'm um, just going to have to pull some money together and then also find a place to... Uh, Try to get this engine out and store this truck for a while. Um, I don't know if I'll have it sent off or how I'm going to get that done, do it by a local shop or maybe try it myself.